Alrighty guys, so um, I'm just going to do a quick video here showing you guys what I've been up to lately. I haven't been uh, making many videos due to work and everything. Um, I've been pretty busy. But I have been working on some things in the background as I get time. Um, so I've been putting the uh, Micro Sky Hunter uh, together. I have it all together. I'm just working on the electronics now. I had some, uh, some issues with it. I am using this receiver here. And this ESC is the one that came with it. And those two do not work together. Um, when I arm it, it automatically goes to quarter throttle, even though my throttle is the whole way down. The weird thing is this ESC will work with my FlySky uh, system. And this uh, uh, receiver here will work with any other ESC I have. So it's just these two will not work together. Um, hopefully I have some new ESCs in here that'll work for it. Um, but we'll go ahead and take a look at that. Um, overall, this airplane was really nice put together. Haven't gotten to fly it yet, but hopefully we can do that soon. Um, I did do some work on my quadcopter here. So when I first got it, I was stupid and plugged it in without putting an antenna on and burned up my, uh, VX or VTX. So I had put a new one of those on. Um, while I was at it, I also upgraded um, the camera to a uh, run cam and then uh, just also did some other modifications with some wiring and stuff like that. Uh, I just flew that tonight with a quick test flight and it flies great. Um, my landing skills are not the best. Um, what else have I been working on? Oh, so when I was out at a flight test... I bought this and had a friend get me started on it, so I'm now starting to use this instead of my uh, Fly Sky back there. So that's that's an upgrade. There's also some other things I've been learning. Um, I've also been working on fixing the airplane that I built out at flight test. Uh, also have some 18650 batteries back there I want to test out. I need to get a charger for them yet. Um, I'm experimenting. I'm experimenting with a 3D printed quad. Um, so I don't know how that's going to turn out. I still have to print some more parts. Uh, yeah, so that's kind of what I've been working on lately. Now, I did get some stuff in the mail. Not enough to do a dedicated mailbag, so I'm just kind of throwing in this update here. Um, I did get this. I'm not sure how you say this. Is it kdex.us? I know that's not how you say it, but... Um, I got this little FPV camera here. Um, it's sort of like the run cam split, I believe, where you can record with it. Um, they also sent some props with it, so might try those out since I need to replace the props on my quad. Uh, so let me go ahead and get this, this open so we can take a look at this. And then also, um, I'll take all this packaging off and we can look to see what I got in here. Alright, so give me one minute here. Alrighty, so got a bunch of goodies here. Um, let's take a look at this camera first. So here it is in the. Here's how it comes in the box. Um, should maybe taken it out the rest of the way. But it basically has the extra little board there that you can put a uh, SD card in, and then the camera um, has the little mounting bracket here. Pull that out so it has a little mounting bracket and uh, it also has the controller here on this side to be able to uh, I guess program it I've never had a camera like this before so I will have to look into it how to actually use it um, and then I want to maybe set this up on my uh, my uh, Volantex Ranger that I have um, there's some information uh, what's next? So, here's some just cheap 30 amp ESCs. Um, there's the information if you guys want to look at them. They were on sale. Um, I wanted to get some just to play around with and also maybe just work putting that over there. Um, but yeah, I should have four of those somewhere here. There's three. Uh, be in there somewhere. Um, I also got this uh, 20 amp ESC for a project, so work on that then. 
Uh, let's see here. Here's the other ESC. So I did get um, some servos here for a project that I want to work on. I got two free fidget spinners. Um, one of the items I was buying, you for every item you bought, you got a fidget spinner for free. I was like, why not? Not that I need them. Um, I did get two brushed um, ESCs. I think these will work for a project I want to do. Um, I'm building a battle bot. Uh, there's a guy, uh, I can't think of his channel name right now. I'll put it down in the description then. Um, where he uh, builds battle bots and stuff and, you know, the ant-sized robots and stuff. And I think these are the ones he uses. Uh, so there's that information. Um, another servo. There's the information just in case you guys want it. And then I also got another uh, receiver here. Uh, so the FR Sky receiver. Here is the information on that if you guys want it. So overall, that's sort of what I've gotten today. I haven't been ordering too much stuff, mainly just because of budget and everything like that. Uh, so yeah, so that's what I've been working on. Um, oh, I've also been working on um, with a thing with uh, hope3d.org. Um, I think this campaign's already filled up, although they said you can sign up for more. But it's a 3D printable reef that they want to uh, submerge into the ocean so here's my pieces for them um you know i think they came out really good 3d printed these uh they're like 20 percent infill two perimeters uh stuff like that this one here was actually pretty interesting i printed it sitting like this with no supports and uh you probably can't see it very well because of being all black but there was a little bit of stringing back there but like this whole top section uh was pretty much a bridge everywhere so it printed really really good for that i did drop the temperature from what i normally do i normally print it like 225 uh, celsius and i dropped it to like 220 to help it cool off faster um this took like 18 hours to print and this one took four or five hours to print so i need to get them packaged up and ship them in uh but yeah besides that i haven't been really doing too much more so uh Hopefully this gives you guys a little bit of what I've been working on. I do want to make some videos here soon of some projects that I uh, have planned. I just haven't started working on them yet. Um, I just need to get time to work on them. And I'll probably end up working on them uh, this this uh, winter when it's dark out. Um, I also have uh, several airplanes there from Flight Fest that I need to build. Uh, so I might work on some of them. Alrighty guys, well I think that's going to be everything for now. Uh, I can't think of really anything else that I wanted to show you guys. But uh, yeah, stay tuned for some projects coming up. And uh, yeah, hopefully you guys uh, like this video and go ahead and subscribe if you want to see more. Alrighty guys, see you later.